Kate, Duchess of Cambridge beamed with pride as she dropped off Princess Charlotte for her first day of primary school. However, the Duchess is especially protective of her daughter for this heartbreaking reason, a royal expert has claimed. Kate, Duchess of Cambridge is idolized by women across the world but the gorgeous mum of three hasn't always felt comfortable in her own skin, a royal insider has claimed. Kate and Prince William were all smiles as they dropped off their middle daughter Princess Charlotte, 4, with her big brother Prince George, 6, for the first time at St. Thomas's school, Battersea last week. However, Kate may be fearful for her daughter because of her own school experience. While it seems hard to believe Kate ever struggled with confidence, she was a quiet and shy child, a royal commentator has claimed. Kate Thornton told Yahoo's Royal Box, she too struggled in her early school years, and during her time at Marlborough College was bullied for being shy. While Kate, like any parent, may fear Charlotte could fall victim to bullying, from what we have seen of the spirited princess she has not inherited her motherless timidness. Princess Charlotte is said to be more confident than her big brother George and often delights royal fans by waving to crowds and playing up to the camera. According to royal expert Katie Nichol, the gutsy princess's tomboy attitude gained her a nickname at nursery school. Royal expert Katie Nichol told Entertainment Tonight, the other nickname that she had when she was at Wilcox Nursery, which was up until just before the summer, was the warrior princess and I'm wondering if that might be a nickname that will stick with her. Apparently she earned that nickname because obviously, she is a princess, but she's quite a tomboy. She loves climbing trees and she's very much an adventurer, she was quite known for her feisty personality. Whether Princess Charlotte's Princess Warrior nickname will stick now she's at big school is yet to be seen. While royal children don't usually have surnames both George and Charlotte take the last name Cambridge at school. Ms. Nichols said, Charlotte will be known as Charlotte Cambridge, so that will be her name when she's called out on the register but I suspect her friends will call her what most of her friends called her at Wilcox Nursery School, which is Lottie. Royal biographer Penny Junner told Hello! Magazine, Prince George is a very protective and lovely older brother. I'm sure he'll look after his little sister and take great pride in showing her the ropes. However, the Queen has previously hinted that may not be the case. Last year, when the Queen met a young prize winner at a school visit, she asked the youngster if she looked after her younger sister Hadla at school. Emily's mother Ellen replied, it's the other way around. The Queen then gave a brief insight into the lives of the Cambridge children, saying, it's like that with Charlotte and George. Prince William has revealed his beloved daughter's favorite thing in the world, and it's extremely adorable. Sharing a sweet insight into his daughter Princess Charlotte during a visit to Harcombe House, Devon, to mark Emergency Services Day on Monday, William revealed that the four-year-old is obsessed with unicorns. The admission came during an art therapy session at the center, while the prince was admiring art made by serving firefighter Dan Bill's three children. While taking in the art, the Duke spotted a plush unicorn made from colorful balls. This prompted him to share with the group Charlotte's love for the mythical creature. He said, My daughter loves unicorns. Loves them. Very cool. The prince's confession came as no surprise to the public, who last week basked in Charlotte's charming first trip to school. The princess was spotted with a unicorn carrying on her Thomas's Battersea School Navy backpack. The sparkly, sequined unicorn twinkled in the sunlight as Mum Kate carried it by her side. As Kate swung the bag around, eagle-eyed royal fans were able to catch a glimpse of the unicorn. Earlier this summer Charlotte was pictured carrying a unicorn purse during the family outing at the King Power Royal Charity Polo Day. In the same visit, William revealed that he plans to train as a volunteer counselor for the text crisis service Shout. Shout recently announced a partnership with the emergency services that will connect Blue Light staff and their families to the support they need. Blue Light staff are those who work in the emergency services. With more pressure piled on emergency services in recent years, concerns over Blue Light staff's mental health have increased. Over a four-year period, the Mental Health Organization, MIND, 
worked with emergency services staff in order to reduce the stigma surrounding workplace stress resulting in unfavorable mental health issues. William spoke with volunteers from the service in order to better understand the work they do. He said, I'm aiming to set myself up for it, I really want to do it. Even if I can only do an hour on my laptop. I want to do the training and be able to help. After seeing Charlotte with the unicorn keyring, toy manufacturers Ty shared their delight on social media. Posting to their Instagram page, they wrote, if you've ever wondered whether or not you have good taste in accessories, you can now be certain that you're just as impeccably accessorized as the royal family. Princess Charlotte used her very own hashtag defashion wristlet to cheer on her daddy at a polo match. We're still completely starstruck. It was the princess's first day of school, with which she was accompanied by brother George. Pictures showed little Charlotte greeting the school's head teacher, Helen Hoslam, with a handshake as she went up on tiptoes.